so welcome back students to one more uh, series that is your log series where i have already given you the trick to find out log without log table now in the second video i have done our uh, like uh, we have already practiced the concept where where to apply log in nernst equation which will be useful in your electrochemistry now i'll be giving you a perfect trick to find out log without using log table here i'll be using the calculus part this particular concept can be used like any number which was given to you you can use apply this concept and apply this trick and solve it let's see suppose in the exam that given you log 53 like in previous video what did we discuss i asked you to remember log 2 value log 3 value log 5 log 7 value isn't it i also showed you i asked you uh, also showed you the value of log 10 log 100 log 1000 right suppose if normal numbers are given to us i can easily opt it suppose if such numbers are given to us like 53 how to find the log first of all log 53 can be written as log 50 plus 3 right fine so why did i take this particular thing fine so uh, here 50 it's easy to find but this 3 value which i have taken first i'll solve the numerical then we'll apply in the calculus formula and see suppose if i have to write log 50 here uh, basically you can take x is equal to 50 i'll tell you what is this x now this can be approximately written as log 50 okay as of now remember 50 plus 1 by 50 into 3 into 0.434 we also know what is this 434 in the later stages now this approximately can be written as log 50 can be written as log 10 plus log 5 isn't it 10 into 5 plus 1 by 50 if i solve this whole thing i get an answer of 0.026 that for the log 10 value i've already studied that is equal to 1 plus log 5 is 0.699 plus which we have already studied 0.026 right when i solve this i get an approximate answer of 1.725 done yes now we'll see step by step using calculus method or the calculus uh, formula or calculus uh, procedure and apply to this and solve first of all when i have to use calculus right now let's see how to solve this above formula how to solve now just see i'm using calculus here as i said now according to calculus where we do the differentiation and uh, you know integration part here according to calculus the formula is f of x plus delta x is approximately equal to f of x plus f dash x into delta x now this is differentiate f of x okay this is differentiate f of x and this what is this x value x value can be an incremental value or decremental value i'll tell you what is that incremental or decremental value right now see so basically <coughs> we write this uh this one under base e is indeed whatever we learn the standard base e value log this can be written as log x plus delta x under base c which is equal to log x base c plus d by dx log x base c into dot x multiplied by delta x now see this is a standard value but we turn uh, we try to write it in the log uh, base 10 isn't it so whatever value we find in this differentiation we try to write it in base 10 natural log this is a natural log we write it in the log 10 when we study so this can be written as log into x plus 1 by x base 10 divided by log e base 10 so this is equal to now log e, x uh, base e so if i take the uh, whole thing when i just uh, write in this cut log x 10 by log e based so d by dx is nothing but 1 by x remember that d by dx is nothing but 1 by x so this is written as 1 by x dot delta x okay remember this quantity fine so the whole uh, thing if i take an lcm of this what do i get i get log into x plus delta x base 10 which is equal to log x base 10 plus delta x by x into 0.434 
okay basically d by dx which is equal to 1 by x here let us just see the example here whatever i have taken okay the same thing this concept i am applying it here see i told d by dx is 1 by x that concept i am applying here that is why i have taken 1 by 50 into 3 okay now what is this factor this is nothing but your when you convert your uh, natural log under base e oh, so there's a natural log under base 10 then you multiply with this correction factor that is 0 0.434 right so when you're converting this factor so this delta x is nothing but that change that delta the correction factor is equal to 4 point 0 0.434 right. so remember d by dx is equal to 1 by x fine so now let us take uh, one example and apply the same thing here suppose if i have an example like like there's a question given to me let us solve this example log 23 is given to me how can i write 23 see basically normal log 20 or 24 it's easy for me now how uh, this and such number is given to me i can use this formula log 24 minus 1 right now what is this value minus 1 it is a decremental value delta delta x is minus 1 here how can i write this now i can written as log 24 plus i told you something isn't it in this case what did i show you i said d by this this is this quantity is this quantity okay this one and d by dx now i'm going to write this form d by dx here what is that d by dx basically it is nothing but minus what is the decremental value minus 1 by 24 okay into the correction factor which we uh, like uh, taken from converting from natural log to you know, the base 10 uh, log x base 10 that is nothing but 0 0.424 now how can you write log 24 as it can be written as log 2 plus log 2 plus log 2 isn't it yes plus it, log 3 how what how so 3 2 is a 6 6 2 is a 12 12 2 is a 24 then yes so my plus your yeah, this is already there <clears throat> fine so when i take this when i solve this i get an answer of 0 0.018 this factor right the decremental value now further <coughs> log 2 how many are there 1 2 3 so 3 into what is log 2 value which you have already studied to 0 0.3010 so this part when i solve uh, log 3 value will write first it is 4771 minus 0 0.018 when i solve this i get an answer of 3621 approximately that's it since the, the perfect answer for log without log table nothing i did i memorized log 2 i memorized log 3 and i applied using calculus now let us come back and do one more example here in this case suppose if a number like 85 is given to me so i need to find log 85 right how can i write let us see log 85 can be written as log 84 plus 1 okay so here x value is nothing but 84 fine so here uh, uh, like uh, the x value 84 where the incremental value is plus 1 isn't it 1 by um, uh, so the first factor which i told you that is d by dx i told you isn't it so the d by dx is uh, if i take x value is 84 but the d by dx value is nothing but 1 by x isn't it okay that 1 by x is plus 1 let's see how can i write this further i can write it as log 84 plus d by dx at all isn't it that is equal to 1 by x so 1 by 84 plus 1 is this incremental value right so we will write this as incremental value is plus 1 okay so d by dx i have written in this form 1 by x into the correction factor 0.434 yeah, four. So when I solve this particular thing, what is how can log 84 be written? It can be written as log 7 plus log 3, right? Plus 2 log 2 correct yes so this particular thing like uh, whole concept will be equal to this now when i solve 1 by 84 into 0 0.3 uh, 434 i get an answer of 0 0.05 the incremental value now let us uh, write the value of 7 i asked you to remember log value of 2 3 5 7 isn't it log 7 value is 0 0.845 what is log 3 value 0 0.4771 now 2 okay what what do we learn log 2 value it is as 3 0 0.3010 plus this value which we have taken as a uh, in multi after multiplying the correction factor this value we have got now we'll add the whole thing i get an answer of 1.9292 
yes so this is how you're going to get i have not used any log table i've used a calculus formula here in that formula i further simplified writing in this way and whatever values i've learned earlier in the first video i've applied that those values and got the answer so this is how you're going to uh, find the perfect log for the given numbers so hope the trick is very clear to you all you can apply the same concept to whichever log value you need to find right so uh, students thank you for watching please do send your comments if hey, further any other suggestions for any other tricks which you all require thank you for watching stay connected